Asayako, my name is Nabila Khan. Um, I'm from the Livermore Pleasanton community, and um, I wanted to thank everybody who has contributed to the fire victim funds that are being collected in this area. Um, I was actually in Chico yesterday, and I want to give you an account of what happened. Um, basically, we went to the Islamic Center of Chico, and they um, sent out flyers to the different um, parking lots and online um, allowing people to know that they're distributing um, cash cards, gas cards, as well as um, clothing items. And uh, we had, alhamdulillah, over a thousand people come and every single person who came to the Islamic Center did not leave empty-handed. They had a card in hand as well as non-perishable food items and clothing. What I realized when speaking to all these people was that the majority of them didn't know about Islam. They didn't even know that the masjid existed. And I had multiple people just say, you know, can I have a hug? And, um, and they were telling me how beautiful our religion is and how wonderful we are as Muslims that we're doing this for them because at this time, they're not getting funds or they're not getting cash where they're able to even buy gas or get things for their kids. Um, so everything that you're doing is wonderful. It's, it's really making a huge difference. Um, I had one man who was telling me that, um, you know, whenever you end up doing another um, distribution date, please let us know. These are evacuees and they want to come and just be around us and spend time with us and help to help other people. So um, I think this is a wonderful thing as Muslims for us to join together and help because it's truly showing our religion through our actions. And I think that speaks louder than words do. So Jazakallah Khair for everything that you guys are doing and uh, please continue to help. Chico, California, in front of the Chico Mosque, and we have one of the evacuees from the campfire here. And I just was telling this nice lady here that I believe that with all this, everything that's been going on between the wars and everything, you know, people have lost sight of how beautiful the Islamic faith is, and, and the Quran is beautiful. And I just, uh, I can't wait until the, the all the battles are over and we all love each other again. Thank you. We wish you the best. All right, we're live here in Chico, California at the Islamic Center of Chico. Um, it's not 12 o'clock yet and we are supposed to start our distribution of goods at 12. We have a table for snacks and food for the heater. Um, Everybody starts out over here. There's a registration. We're making sure that uh, people who are affected are the ones who are getting the supplies. So the first line is here. And once they've registered, you go to the next line. And we're not having people get items until 12 o'clock because we want to be fair that the time that we've given is a time that everybody is um, allowed to start. If we move over here, we have volunteers and here with uh, non-perishable food items. And then we've organized the clothes in different sizes. So there's small men's walk over. And we've got volunteers helping individuals with the sizing, so it goes faster. Okay. Uh, sorry. Don't want to interrupt your video. <laughs> you had it ready for me. And the air quality is actually very bad here. Um, there, it's smoky. There's a stench, um, and it, your throat is there's a sting to your throat. So they've recommended that everybody wear masks. And we're walking 
walking over to where we've got Does snacks have any for everybody. We've got water bottles and healthy snacks. Thank you guys for volunteering. Yeah, you're if we go in, we got some apples there. If we go in, we also have masks for people. There are showers. Uh, we just need to make sure somebody is here at the mosque. We brought them out. We brought just brought kids out. And this is the lady side, and we've got more items here. Right. So everybody who has donated, this is where the money is going to. And as you can see, we're trying to do it in an orderly fashion. Um, yeah, when we're going to start giving them a card, they're supposed to come from here and go back and get their stuff, whatever they need, and then they go back. So it won't be like bottleneck. Okay. So that's your duty. You're gonna stand here. One gonna be standing here, and other one gonna be. Standing. So you'll your usher duty. people in yeah, the direction, direction that they yeah. need to go. Yeah.